February 6, 1818. Good morning. Though still in bed, my thoughts go out to you, my immortal beloved. Now joyfully, then sadly, waiting to learn whether or not fate will hear us. I can live only wholly with you, or not at all. Yes, I am resolved to wander so long away from you until I can fly to your arms and say that I am really at home, send my soul enwrapped in you into the land of spirits. Yes, unhappily it must be so. You will be the more resolved since you know my fidelity to you. No one can ever again possess my heart. None, never. Oh God, why is it necessary to part from one whom one so loves? And yet my life in Vienna is now a wretched life. Your love makes me at once the happiest and the unhappiest of men. At my age, I need a steady, quiet life. Can that be under our conditions, my angel? I have just been told that the mail coach goes every day, and I must close at once so that you may receive this letter at once. Be calm. Only by a calm consideration of our existence can we achieve our purpose to live together. Be calm. Love me. Today. Yesterday. What tearful longings for you. 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 My life. My all. Farewell. Oh, continue to love me. Never misjudge the most faithful heart of your beloved Ludwig. Ever thine, ever mine, ever for each other. Ludwig van Beethoven